battle of the tape for this middleweight fight. And now with the official introductions, the veteran voice of the Octagon, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC middleweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a ballet judo fighter. He stands six feet two inches tall. Steve Mazzagatti, our referee. Michael Bisping, Dan Henderson. And here we go. Michael Bisping transitioning to 185 in absolutely great condition now. And his fight against Charles McCarthy was a wake-up call to everybody in the UFC's middleweight division. As was his fight with Jason Day, where I think we saw the best version of Michael Bisping yet. Eats a jab. Combination, left, right. Pushing forward quickly. Postured up. Quick jab. He's eating some punches. Swing and a miss. Oh, just missed. Trying to find the range. Body shot. Now this is a good position for Henderson. Just missed with that one. Oh, just missed. Oh, good kick to the body. Just missed. Oh, caught it right there. Caught a left, pardon me, jab. Midway through round number one. Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. He's got a sprawl. Henderson loves to posture up, and he has some good ground and pound from the top. Henderson on top of you is a very dangerous thing. Nice left hands. Bisping on his back, he's going to try to get back up, isn't he? he? He might, but he's also dangerous from a submission standpoint. Another hammer fist. Listen to this building, partner. Is this any good or what? And stuffs another takedown attempt. Looking for the knockout punch. Oh. Nice leg kick. Joe, what's the key on the inside leg kick from a defensive point of view? You got to check it. You got to either check it or you got to get your leg out of the way. Good body shot. 45 seconds remains. That left kick had a little power to it. You heard the snap. Nice work. He's got the double underhooks. And he decides to let him up. Tried to come around with the left. Trying to come over the top. Came with the overhand right. What a great brawl here tonight. These guys are really battling each other. Let's take a look at some of that action here. When you land those combos, you can come back with a front kick at the end after the round kick. In case he's charging in, all right? Everything else looks good. You're going to catch it. Take up the breast. The only thing when you're, uh, when you're rocking him stand up, just uh, don't jump in his guard. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The beautiful Ariani helps us to get round two started. Set for round two. This fight's scheduled for three five-minute rounds. Joe, there have been some that have said you just aren't afforded the same opportunities in Britain as a mixed martial artist as you are in the United States. But yet the majority of Bisbing's training still takes place in the UK, yet he continues to advance. I think that's an antiquated notion, and I think that things are changing. I think, uh, I mean, with especially now, Quentin Rampage Jackson is actually relocated to the UK to train with the Wolf Slayer for his upcoming fights. Um, and I think that just that alone is indicative of uh, a new trend, um, that it's, it's a global sport now, and that the UK mixed martial arts scene is huge huge now and there's great training there there's a looking for the arm bar he's got to get the leg over the face can he get oh, oh yes nice escape lets him up trying to find the range 
Body uppercut. And he caught him again. He ate that one. And again, connects with a right. Working in the clinch. Body shot. And another left hand. Nice job with the uppercut. Good body shot. Oh, and nice again. body shots. He's looking for the high leg finish, undoubtedly. He missed that kick. Just missed with that one. Missed with the kick. See if he goes to it again. Misses with the kick. Oh, wow. Almost got him there. 